Hello everyone, how are you today? This is Raya again and welcome to She Serenity's episode. For today's episode, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to cook dinner. As you can see, I'm here in my small kitchen and I'm going to cook pasta. It's called spaghetti alle vongoli. It's an Italian dish and it is very easy to make, especially for a very busy housewife like me. So join me as I am preparing our dinner. Everyone, this is our ingredients, a fresh clams, a pasta, spaghetti, a cherry tomato. Cherry tomato, it, it is optional. You can use the normal tomato if you want. And this is parsley and garlic and of course the olive oil uh, i'm using spanish olive oil so these are the the main ingredients and uh, there's also one ingredient which is a white wine but for today's uh, recipe i'm not gonna add that white wine because i have my niece coming so she's going to eat the spaghetti also so let's start our cooking so guys, the first thing we have to do is to add our olive oil. As our olive oil is already hot, we will put the garlic. Garlic. Once your garlic is like brownish already and you can smell the aroma you can add the cherry tomato For me so as you can see, the tomato is soft and there's a, like the oil is also coming out. We can add our plants. Okay. I added a lot of clams as I told you this recipe is very easy but you can upgrade it to whatever you want so for us we have a lot of clams and my family wanted to eat that clams together with the the pasta so I put all the clams but for you if you, how much clams you have at home you can put it as you like Yanni. but for me because we have a lot already I want to add it because we enjoy this small little clams so I already put everything, now I'm gonna put the parsley. So guys, mind you, don't put salt yet or anything. You have to try it because the clams is a bit salty. Uh, you know, it's coming from the sea. So you have to try the, the um, you have to try it first and see how salty it is. Then you can garnish it. You can uh, put uh, pepper and salt according to the taste you like. So now I'm gonna add the parsley. Okay, and keep it like that so all the juice of the clumps will go out so I can know how salty it is for me to add uh, something. Uh, as I've been telling you earlier in the video that I'm not going to add a wine because of my, my knees so I'm going to add only water. I'm going to add water. Little. And I forget to tell you, but that if you want it a little bit spicy, you can add chili also. Uh, it's either chili flakes or the actual chili. You can add two, three pieces, just to chop it into small pieces. So for me, we wanted it to be a little bit spicy, so I'm gonna add the chili flakes. Like this. This is Korean chili flakes. It's not that much, so just to give it a little bit of a kick. Uh, guys, time to add our pasta. It's easy. Just pour it like that. And then mix it. Mix it, mix it. This is gonna be a lot of 
worth to do when we are eating it because there's a lot of clams with it so guys this is it our spaghetti al bongoli uh we just we will just simmer it for a couple of minutes so everyone we finished cooking our dinner so this is it spaghetti al bongoli so we have to try Mmm, it's so nice. It tastes so fresh, and I just love it. It's very simple, you know. You can taste everything like simply. So um, usually, when we are eating some, uh, I will put aside like. Parmesan if somebody wants to have cheese on top of it and uh, olive oil because uh, me Personally, I love to put more olive oil on top when I'm eating it. Thank you for watching everyone I hope you like our episode for today and uh, you like also the recipe that I make so um, I hope you will like and subscribe if you are new to my channel Thank you very much. Have a good one